up and down, turn colors, fly and run. Your mind will grow with all you know and fill your brain with fun. And fill your brain with fun. So come along to our house where big adventure starts. Reach for the stars and you'll be a superstar of smarts. Six Sixers Kindergarten. If you're a big thinker, we should have your name in our book of big thinkers. If you've been here before, just click on your name and let's play. If this is your first time visiting us, enter a new name. Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Little Bumble Bear's Let's Play. Hello, my wonderful friends. I hope you're having a fantastic day or night whenever you're watching this. I'm back with more Humongous Entertainment. We just finished the bug buzzy the knowledge bug series and i realized we don't have any big thinkers on my channel start, but i happen to have says, kindergarten and play. first grade so that's what's gonna be coming soon well we got kindergarten today first grade coming soon i mean but yes please if you like the video i encourage you to leave a comment down below telling me if you remember playing this game leave a like and if you really enjoy it, why not consider subscribing and joining my amazing Beehive family? Because I love before, meeting new people, your name and, and I love sharing play. the memories with you guys. So a quick thank you to everyone who is here, who is subscribed, who watches my videos. I love you guys. You are loved and special. Never forget that. I stream on Twitch. Feel free to go check out my channel. If you watch Twitch streams, you can come say hi to me and hang out with me when you catch me live. I have a Twitter and Instagram. Why not follow me? Keep up to date when with what's going on. Start, you can even send me a little play. hello. And I have a Discord server if you'd uh, like to come to my HQ where I hang out a lot with the other members of my community. Just ask for an invite in the comments and I will shoot you a Discord invite. Well, without further ado, let's begin. As you can see, I've played this before, but I'm going to make a new profile. To start, click. Are you sure you want to? I'm gonna make a brand new profile just for you. There we go. Oh, I love the bee because I'm I'm a little bumblebee. Enter your name if you'd like to play. And what do you know? My birthday is the uh, today. Wee! No, that's today. That's today. Happy Mother's Day, everyone. <laughs> All right, let's go. You can do amazing things at our house. And today is your birthday. Well, we've got a surprise for you. It's hidden somewhere around our house. See if you can find it. Go ahead and click anywhere. There's lots to discover. Wherever the arrow turns into a star, there's a game we can do. Every game is a chance to earn smart stars, the sign of success. You'll save up smart stars in your brain bank, which you can check anytime. None yet. Collect enough smart stars, and you can take the Superstar of Smarts Challenge. Once you've been to a few places, Think and Go makes it easy to get around. In some activities, you can choose how hard you want it to be by clicking here. Beginning, medium, or hardest. And you can leave our house anytime by clicking here on our exit door. When you click on Ben or me during the game, we'll try to give you some help. All right, let the fun begin. Let's go find some smart stars. All right, let's go find some smart stars. Let's see. The book smart of chart. Thinkers. Your smart chart keeps track of all the smart stars you ever earned. Even smart stars you used up in the Superstar of Smarts Challenge will still show up here. If you ever want to change your brain bank, click here to go back to the sign-in page. You found it! Aww! Happy birthday! Thank Happy you! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! <laughs> Guess what I'm thinking? You're thinking big thoughts! You get different colored smart stars for different kinds of smarts. 
Alright, let's go here. The Superstar Smart Challenge! We're cleared for launch! <laughs> it's the Superstar Smart Challenge! And your chance to show that your smarts are out of this world! You need at least a smart star of each color to play. Oh, well, I'm no not problem. ready. Let's get some more smart stars. We'll come back. Okay, we'll come Let's back. Let's pick up more smart stars. Let's They're all go. around our house. This way. Hey, what's going on in my bedroom? Yike! It looks like a tornado came through here. I oh hope you goodness. can help me put my room back together. Just click on a piece you want to move, then click where you think it should go. Okay. What happened in here? You've certainly helped put our house in order, so put these in your brain bank. <laughs> Click on the new button for another bedroom puzzle. All right, let's do it. See what you can do this time. Ooh. On the new button for another bedroom puzzle. Here we go again. Uh, <laughs> I love this game. It's so wacky and fun. Okay, I think I get the theme. Everything is upside down. certainly there helped we put our house in order, so put these in your brain bank. <laughs> Click on the new button for another bedroom puzzle. Whoa! <gasps> oh my goodness, I see some... I see familiar face. Do you guys know who this is down here? I know who this is. If you've played the Humongous Entertainment games, you'll know who it is, too. You've certainly helped put our house in order, so put these in your brain bank. <laughs> Click on the new button for another bedroom puzzle. Let's get it together. Even underwater, I can tell you're on top of things. Smart stars! <laughs> things in here are messier now, so you'll earn four smart stars every time you put my room back in order. You can flip pieces upside down by clicking on the arrows that point up and down. Okay. That's right, we can do a hard difficulty, I totally forgot. Alright, we'll do a couple more. And we'll 
we'll try the hardest difficulty, okay? My room looks better than new, so I see smart stars coming to you! <laughs> on the new button for another bedroom puzzle. All right, let's do hard. Hardest. Some of the pieces may not be facing the right way. The arrows pointing. Hmm. the new button for another bedroom puzzle. Time to gather myself together and go. Okay, uh? okay we've got 24 of those. We need to get the others. Let's go. Let's try over here. With so many books, we have our own library. We love to read. I've always that. wanted a portrait of myself. Maybe you can help. Okay, Ben. Now hold still while we give you a new look. We can put funny face stickers on Ben. Or start with an empty face by using the button that changes heads. Like this. Now, let's paint a face with the brush. Or use the face stickers. Does this have difficulty with this? No, it's just right Okay. And let's make up a face. Are, uh, are you sure you want to start? Whoa, that's trippy, no. Are you sure you... Normal face, please, thank you. <laughs> oh, I think I saw a little... If you want to see a different face part, there click we on the go. arrow next to... We're gonna make him a bumble bear. <laughs> Not the kind of hair a bumble bear has. 
that covers his ears. Um, he'll be a, a punk bumblebear. There you go. Laugh. Yeah, he's gonna, he's gonna have a uh, really edgy hairdo. Like that. Black and yellow. first. From a distance. Oh, that's lovely. That was fun. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, these are the credits. How are you? It's great to see. Okay. Reading is great. This is my favorite book. You can change around the story by clicking each green word. The picture will change too. Click on me anytime you want me to read your story. Leprechaun. Oh, the bear. Looks for beans. On the other side of a. Uh, I like. I want to keep the rainbow there. A fairy tale. The bear looks for beans on the other side of the rainbow. Do you see Ben disguised as a scarecrow? Leprechaun looks for gold on the other side of the beanstalk. Do you see Ben disguised as a tree? Yes, I do. A, a fairy tale. The giant looks for porridge on the other side of the bridge. Do you see Ben disguised as a sign? memoirs. Isn't the beach fun? The sun is setting over a blue sea. Those crabs are watching Ben make castles in the sand. Brightly beach memoirs. Isn't the beach fun? The television is setting over a pink sea. Those walruses are watching Ben make pyramids in the sand. To make a long story short, you've earned more smart stars! Yay! Yeah! So we're on the third thing now. So tan, starfish, music, pumpkin, polka dot. Pizza. Brightly Beach Memoirs. Isn't the beach fun? The pumpkin is setting over a polka dot sea. Those surfers are watching Ben make pizza in the sand. <laughs> Baby Ben. Ben's arms look like cheese, his head like a cake, his legs look like keys, and his body like a rake. Baby Ben. Ben's arms look like Z's, his head like a milkshake, his legs look like bees, 
and his body like a snake. against the elephant, the pitcher just threw a curveball. Do you think the batter can hit it with that salmon? Starlight, star bright. We got more stars. Birds. It's the bats. They threw a mothball. <laughs> and they're batting with a pickle. It's the newts against the alligators. And they threw a glue ball. Can they hit it with that mouse? A computer mouse, not a animal. The flies against the spiders threw a hairball. And they are hitting it with a sausage. This makes me think of backyard baseball. Jack and the Ben stock. Jack the rabbit planted some beans. They didn't grow, but Ben's helping by being a beanstalk. Can Jack get past the dogs? stars to get. I think we get two more. Or no, 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 no. We just need one more. I'm sorry, I didn't even see the blue one was filled in. You've discovered our playroom! You know where that leads. To our music room. The stage is set for making music. Let's play a tune together, Becky. We can play the instruments you see on the walls. I have four. And I have four. I... Thank you. 
I know you'll like this next song, Smart Stars, yeah! Will be music to your ears. Smart stars! Oh, yeah, we're smart stars. There we go. Good job, guys. We're doing a great job. I love smart stars. On that note, let's go! Becky doesn't belong. That's right. Which Becky doesn't exactly match the others? A fine choice. Can you tell which Becky looks different? Let's see. Something's different same. about one of them, but I can't quite put my finger on it. Is it? Take a closer look and try again. Hmm. Nice going. Okay. Click on the Becky that looks different than the other two. Good eye. Can you tell which Becky looks different? Oh, the shoes. You found her. You'd make a great detective. Which Becky doesn't belong? We love to swim anytime. There's a whole wet world of wonders down here. Look, that clam has something inside it. What could it be? The fish below are trying to spell out what's in the clam shell. Huh? 
Wait, I thought I did have blue stars. Oh, maybe I don't. Maybe, maybe I thought I did. Oh, oh well. All right, let's spell jet. jet. That's it. Can you teach me the backstroke? Come on. Click the letter on Ben or me that completes the word below. Nut. You got it. What's a fish like you doing in a tank like this? I live here. Oh, yeah. Fox. You've done swimmingly. Which means you deserve more smart stars. Now the missing letter might be the first, middle, or last letter of each word. Dog. You're thinking big. Click the letter on Ben or me that com... Elf. Just the letter they needed. Click the letter on... Cat. You're good at this. Ahoy, smart star! Alright, let's do the hardest level. Beginning. Medium. Hardest. Our fish friends have invited their cousin to join in. Now their words will all be four letters long. Feet. You're thinking big. Math. You picked the right letter. I feel a bit dizzy. Don't tell me you're getting seasick. Dog. You're good at this. Ahoy, smart star. <laughs> Stars on the fence in the backyard. Okay. So we're gonna get some purple stars around here. Should go there. We could, we could do something over there. Alright. Well let's start let's over here. surf down the path and see where it leads. Oh! What's the matter? I think there's something in my shoe. Your foot? No, besides that. That's all in your shoe? Wow, you weren't kidding. Hmm. Which things up there start with the letter K? K makes the sound. You mean like what my name? The two things that start with that letter. T. Kangaroo. A fine choice. Whoa! It's like we won the lottery. Congratulations. <laughs> Which things up there start with the letter G? G makes the sound G. Click on the two things that start with that letter. Go! Gate. You've done it again! We'll just tidy up a little. <laughs> Way to pick them! Time for some smart stars! <laughs> Which things up there start with the letter I? I makes the sound I. Click on the two things that start with that letter. Okay, we don't have an opportunity to change the level. That's okay. Okay, let's go 
here. Looks like someone's been littering back there. Let's clean it up together. You can put each piece of litter in its proper place. I'm a recycling bin. If an item can be recycled, you can give it to me. Some things can't be recycled where we live. Put that litter in me, the trash can. Before you start, try this little game. Click on which one of us you think will end up with more pieces of litter. And let's see if I get the most. Notebook paper. A lot of water is used to make paper from trees. So, a newspaper. Rag. True. Dirty cloth can't be recycled. But old clothing could be reused if it's not too torn. An old sock. Try again. An old sock. Keep the trash coming. A styrofoam food box. Styrofoam can be recycled in some places, but not where we live. A candy wrapper. That can be A candy wrapper. A tire. That doesn't belong in a tire. Yeah. Car tires are ground into tiny pieces, then used in doormats and to cover playgrounds. A glass bottle. Good. Did you know that glass can be recycled over and over? It never wears out. A balloon. That doesn't... A balloon. You clearly cleared this clearing of clutter. Looks like I got more of the litter than Ben. Which one of us will get more of this litter? Hmm. Watch the numbers to see if I get the most. A cardboard box. A paper bag. A hairbrush. That's a pie pan. A broken vase. Pottery. A pie pan. That's not trash. Pie pan. Aluminum, steel, and tin are just a few of the metals that can be recycled. Nice going. That's what I call good, clean fun. You sure know how to put things in their place. So put these in your brain bank. Can I get some purple stones? There we go. We got our purple. Let's see. I've got more pieces of recycling than Becky has trash. Will I get more litter this time? Or will Ben? Alright, let's go level 2. Medi hardest. Right. Medium. There's even more litter to be cleaned up now. Will I get more litter this time? Or will Ben? You guessed me! Okay, let's start. A tire. A pie pan. A balloon. A candy wrapper. A broken vase. A hairbrush. Right. A cardboard box. A paper bag. A paper bag. Newspaper. Notebook paper. An envelope. A candy wrapper. You can pick up litter by clicking on it. A two liter soda pop. A spray can. Try again. A spray can. A styrofoam. You really know how to sort things out. Let's see. I've got more pieces of recycling than Becky has trash. Will I get more litter this time? Or will Ben? You think I'll get the most litter. A styrofoam? Rags. What a load of rubbish. A spray can. An old sock. A phone book. A tin can. A glass jar. That will be too. Plastic milk. Good one. A two liter soda. A light bulb. That doesn't belong in the recycling. A light bulb. A glass bottle. You've made another clean sweep. Two, four, six, eight. For sorting trash, here's something great. Mark star. Here we go. And you were thinking big. I did end up with more pieces than Becky. Here's a smart star bonus. Which one of us will get more of this litter? Alright, let's do the hardest litter. Hardest. This is as tough as it gets. Think big. Which one of us will get more of this litter? Watch the numbers to see if I get the most. A hairbrush. A balloon. Rags. Keep the trash. A candy wrapper. A banana peel. Yeah. A candy wrapper. A light bulb. A styrofoam cup. 
A cardboard box. A tire. Good one. A glass bottle. Newspaper. A two liter soda. A glass jar. A milk carton. Wait a, a french fry box. That can't be a french fry. A dirty paper plate. A dirty paper plate. A dirty paper. Try again. A dirty paper. Paper that still has food on it can only be thrown away. You've clearly cleared this clearing of clutter. You guessed me. Here's a smart star bonus. Which one of us will get more of this litter? You think I'll get the most litter. Okay, well, we got. Thanks for we your help enough. cleaning up. Let's, Let's clear out of here. <laughs> Something fun to do. Okay. We'll go in here in a second. Let's go back out here. I just want to see if this took us inside the house. Okay. Let's. Oh my goodness. We can go. Wait, we just came from this way, right? From the forest. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, let's start with this. I think I hear someone calling us back there. Let's go check it out. Pardon me, my friends and I need a place to perch. Can you help us? Sure, thanks. If I have one bird and Ben has zero birds, how many birds in all? Click the fence post showing the number you think is right. One. You're obviously not a bird brain. Bye now! <laughs> If I have zero birds, and Becky has two birds, how many birds in all? Two. I can tell you're a big thinker. Plenty of a room for all of us. If I have zero birds, and Ben has three birds, how many birds in all? Three. Good going. Ciao. Bring on the smart star. Alright, we got some. Plenty of a room for all of us. If I have two birds and Becky has three birds, how many birds in all? Medium. Some of these questions are going to get even tougher. Meeting time at the birdhouse. Plenty of a room for all of us. There is one red bird. And there are three green birds. How many birds all together? Four. I knew you had it right. Do you know the way to San Juan Capistrano? If I have four birds, and Ben has two birds, how many birds in all? Six. Your thinking skills are really taking flight. Hi there! There are three blue birds. And there are two green birds. How many birds all together? Five. You're a natural born number cruncher. You deserve more smart stars. Alright, let's do the hardest level. There is one blue bird. And there are two purple birds. How many birds all together? Hardest. 
Let's throw in some harder questions. See you later. Do you know the way to San Juan Capistrano? If I have five birds, and Becky has five birds, how many birds in all? Hi there! Ten! I can tell you're a big thinker. I've got flip to go and bird to see. There are two red birds. And there are four green birds. How many birds all together? Six. I knew you had it right. There are five blue birds. And there are five green birds. How many birds all together? Ten. You're obviously not a bird brain. Off we go! Bring on the smart star! Alright! Plenty of a room for all of us. If together Ben and I have six birds and two birds fly away, how many birds will we have left? Got to clean the nest! It looks like there's a whole world down there. That gives me an idea. Let's play hide and seek. I'll hide. Ben! Oh, Ben! I guess he wasn't kidding about hide and seek. After each of my clues, click somewhere on the screen to make a guess. Okay, here's your first clue. He's hiding somewhere built by people. Sorry, he must be somewhere else. Maybe another clue will help. Your first clue was, he's hiding somewhere built by people. Your second clue is, he's next to the pasture. Not here. All right, you get one more clue and one more guess. Your first clue was, he's hiding somewhere built by people. Your second clue was, he's next to the pasture. And your third and final clue is, Ben is between an island and the big city. There we Correct. go. Correct! You really know your geography. Ben's going to hide again. No peeking. Come look for me. Okay, here's your first clue. Ben is getting very wet. Not here. Maybe another clue will help. Your first clue was, Ben is getting very wet. Your second clue is, Ben is close to an island. Your future is full of smart stars. Yay! More smart stars! Good job, guys. I knew you could do it. Ben's going to hide again. No peeking. Come look for me. Okay, here's your first clue. He's hiding somewhere out I'm done hiding. <laughs> Wait until you see our garden. It's amazing. <laughs> Wow, this looks like a maze. I'll need your help to figure out how to get through it. Just click on the path I should take to get through this part of the garden. Okay. Is there? There's a little bit. Okay. Oh, I see what to do. got a great sense of direction. Which path should I follow oh, to get through I here? I see a star. Do you guys see it? I'll need to find another.
All right, come on, let's chant the chicken cheer. More smart stars. All right. Which path should I follow to get through here? All right, let's do level two. Medium. These mazes oh, keep getting tougher, but I'm sure that with your help, I can still find my way. I can't get around this pile of food unless you can help me figure out which of these animals I should turn into. Then I could eat up all the food and keep on moving. Horse, now click on the pile. This food, of course, is for a horse. <laughs> I see the way out of here. You've got a great sense of direction. Which path should I follow to get through here? Monkey, now click on the pile of food you want me. I go bananas for bananas. <laughs> Now, hey, hey, hey! <laughs> this calls for a victory dance. How about the bunny hop? Da 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 More smart stars! All right! <laughs> Which path should I follow to get through here? All right, let's do level one. Hardest. Now things are even tougher, so you'll get five smart stars for every two mazes you get through. Isn't all this food making you hungry? Okay, I see the map. I can't get around this pile of food unless you can help me figure out which of these animals I should turn into. Then I can eat up all the food and keep on moving. Lizard, now this is what I call fine dining. Rabbit, this looks delicious. I wish I'd brought some dressing. Chicken, I feel the need for seed. <laughs> Horse, hey, hey, hey. Chicken, I feel the need for seed. <laughs> You've got a great sense of direction. Boy, this garden keeps growing and growing and growing. Okay. I see it's down here. Chicken. Mm -hmm. Beak licking good. <laughs> Horse. <laughs> Chicken. Horse. Hey, hey, hey. All right. Come on. Let's chant the chicken cheer. More smart stars. All right. knew our garden was so big? <laughs> you right. can never be too full of ideas. So we got something there. We got something in the fridge. <laughs> 
below in the same order as okay. they are in the alphabet. There we go. I know she would give you multiple tasks, so Medium. I didn't want to miss this. Things are a little tougher now. Think big. Switch around the letters on the cloud below. Nice going. Pick a letter. H is for hat. Let's correct the order of some other letters. Alright! Letter perfect! I can be anything! I is for igloo! Let's 
try this game again. Everything looks in order. You really put things in order around here. Now let's try something new. See if you can figure out which letter makes the sound N. Click on the letter above, you pick N. Sounds good to me. Pick a letter and let J is for jam. Choose the letter above that makes the sound I. I. That's right. What should I become this time? L is for light bulb. Choose the letter above that makes the sound T. T. That's the one. Now hear this. Congratulations. You've earned smart stars. Thank you. See if you can put the letters below in the same All right, part. now we'll do hard. This is as tough as it gets. For this part, we'll hide the alphabet. Switch around the letters. That's it to the letter. I can be anything in the alphabet. M is for mountain. Now try to put the... Everything looks in order. What should I become this time? N is for net. Let's try this game again. What's the right order for these letters? Everything looks in order. Looks like you've got all the right moves. I know another way we can play. I'll say a whole word, and you see if you can figure out which letter starts that word. What's the first letter in the word? Magic. Hmm. Sounds good to me. Pick a letter and O is for owl. Click on the letter that sounds like the beginning of the word gold. G. That's right. Pick a letter. Any letter. P is for pineapple. Toss. What's the first letter in that word? T. That's the one. You've done great. Now see how you like the sound of this. Smart stars. See, right. time flies when you're having fun, and so do I. Hey, that gives me a bubbling good idea. I'll start by blowing some bubbles. Each set of bubbles I blow follows a pattern. Can you figure out which bubbles come next? Click on this hand to choose the shape of the next bubble. And this hand to choose the color. When you're ready to create that bubble, click on the blue question marks up above. What do you think are the next three bubbles in this pattern? Okay. Square, triangle, yellow, blue, red, purple, green. Nice match. Circle. Good one. Nice match. I can tell you've blown bubbles before. How about this one? are the next three bubbles in this pattern. Square. Nice match. Red, purple. That works. Nice match. You've got quite a talent for this. Let's try another pattern now. Your smarts really blow my mind. All right. What do you think are the
the next three bubbles in this pattern. Medium. What do you think are the next three bubbles in this pattern? Yellow. Good one. That works. Yellow. Blue. Good one. Great job. Tiny bubbles in my mind. What do you think are the next three bubbles in this pattern? Hardest. Let's do the hard level. Now I've created a complete bubble pattern, but one of the bubbles doesn't match the rest of the pattern. Click on the bubble you think is wrong. Green, red, yellow. Green, red, yellow. Oh, got it. Now use my hands to create the bubble that goes in that spot. Then click on the question mark. I see you're developing a pattern for success. Get ready for some fresh suds. On the bubble that does not fit the pattern I've created. Let's see what other fun is floating around. Time to feed our minds. They get hungry too. What's going on in our refrigerator? I don't know, but I'm sure it's something cool. Look at all the food in here. Everything's a different size. Hey, that gives me an idea. How many carrots would stack up just as tall as I am now? Start by then stacking another, or try to guess the answer. One. You've got a good eye. Let's try another. How many eggs would be as tall as I am? One. One. You've got a good eye. Your big thinking has reached all new heights. Now try some smart stars on for size. <laughs> How many carrots would stack up just as tall? Oh, let me do level two. Medium. Some of these questions are going to get even tougher. How many jars of mustard would equal my height now? One. Exactly. Let's try another. How many olives would stack up as tall as I? Way to go! Your big thinking has reached all new heights. Now try some smart stars on for size. How many olives would stack up as tall as I am? Hardest. Some of these questions are going to get even tougher. How many jars of mustard would equal my height now? Three. Exactly. How about this? How many eggs would be as tall as... Two. You've got a good eye. Your big thinking has reached all new heights. Now try some smart stars on for size. How many bottles of bubbling brightly? This activity gave me lots of food for thought. Alright, I think it's time to start the challenge. Your big moment has arrived. Time for the superstar of Smarts Challenge. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Which color star? Nobody knows. This time you'll have a... Language Arts Challenge. It takes Smart Star Power to play the challenge. Okay. 
Charging up! It's my turn! Let's go for a spin! The object on each satellite starts with a letter you'll find on the path. Which satellite has a match that's the farthest down the path? Apple! Time to spin the satellites again. Spinning the satellites uses up star power. So get as far along the path as you okay. can each time. Oh, cow. There. Cow. Right? Yeah. Let's go. Okay, house. house. For elephant. Elephant's farther. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Barn. Bar okay, that's B. Key. Jar. Volcano. Okay. Jar. <laughs> Rake. Rake. Skate. Rake. I think we're gonna make it, guys. We're almost there. Okay, moon or saw? Saw. Definitely moon. Now we're getting somewhere. Okay. Frog. Or spoon. Spoon. One more, guys. One more. Owl. And away we go. Last one. House. I'm on the moon. All the way. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Which color star? Nobody knows. This time you'll have a... Map challenge. It takes smart star power to play the challenge. Loading up the star power. I'm ready to go. Let's spin. The clock's time on each satellite matches the time along the path. Which satellite will move me farther? Spinning the satellites uses up star power, so get as far along the path as you can. Six o'clock. Four o'clock. Four o'clock. Four o'clock. Full blast. Spin again. Get okay, two o'clock and seven, seven o'clock. There's two o'clock and there's seven o'clock. Warp speed. Okay, one o'clock and Twelve six o'clock. o'clock. Uh... Oh, it's 12 o'clock. I apologize. What o'clock? No? Okay. 4 o'clock. 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock. We're almost there. Six o'clock. Six o'clock. Six o'clock. Okay. Six o'clock. Oh, blast! <laughs> Without a doubt, you were up to the challenge. Congratulations! You've earned the title Superstar of Smart. We did it! We did it! Are you ready to start another Superstar of Smarts challenge? Let's get back down to Earth. You can keep any Smart Stars you have left. 
Star of Smarts, Big Thinkers. Oh my goodness, I, I worked my whole life for this, guys. I I wanted to be the kindergarten superstar of smarts. I'm gonna print this out and put it on my wall. Thank you, thank you everyone. Thank you, Becky, thank you, Ben, thank you, Humongous Entertainment. If you like, you can print out your certificate. Well guys, that concludes this episode of Little Bumble Bears Let's Play. I certainly hope you enjoyed. Remember, please, Give the video a like, leave a comment down below telling me how you liked the video, your memories of this game, and please subscribe for more nostalgic gaming. Check out the playlist in the description box. It has all the other Humongous Entertainment games I've done on this channel. Remember, you are special and loved, you are never alone, and you're always welcome to come hang out. Until the next episode, I love you all. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye, everyone.